Hello everybody, my name is Alava and welcome back to Game of Thrones Telltale series. Now, we are currently Asher, uh, trying to make our way back to Ironrath. Obviously, Ethan's dead, shit's kicking off. We're getting hunted by those dudes. They were yeah. headed for the main gate. And they're I know the another way. Gate. You're coming with us then. If you're to save your house, you'll need more than the two of us at your side. You'll need an army. That's why you're here, isn't it? To hire one. An army of sellsorts. And a man to lead them. I will lead them. Do you hear what I'm saying, boy? Beska can lead them. What? She's stronger than most knights in Westeros. This is your fight, Asher. Your family. None of that matters without sellswords to hire. And all the companies around here are engaged. What about Croft? One-eyed Croft, with the second sons. Ooh, They're all with the Targaryen girl now. Yeah. But Croft owes me a favor. I'm pretty sure he hates you, actually. No. He'll help us. I'll make sure of it. And how are you going to do that? We didn't part on the best of terms. I'll figure something out. Not exactly a plan, though, is it? Don't worry. He'll get it done. Yeah, yeah I will. You worried, Malcolm. Stand in. Well, this mother of dragons and her sellswords are headed north, so we make for Marine. Wait. Marine? Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't afford any distractions. It's not your problem. It'll be fine. I promise. Uh, all right. It's fine. I trust you, Beska. If you say so. I shouldn't have said anything. I said I was with you, little brother. And I meant it. Oh, shit. Ponte Renas! Don't guy in a Josie, but Dagon Costotti Daor. Don't guy. Well, we are gonna leave Sunshine, so. Oh, look here. They are pretty sweet armor, mate. I'll give them that. There's always one. Ooh. I should have killed him, to be fair. Just one more fight. we'll have to kill later. Yeah, good Let's go. You did well back there, Asher. You acted like a true leader. You two can talk about it later. We need to get out of here. They won't stop looking for us. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. I hope you're ready, Asher. Oh, I'm fucking ready. It won't be easy. Just try to keep up, Uncle. Don't you worry about me. Either we cross the narrow sea with an army at our backs, or House Forrester will not survive to see winter. Who am I next? Mira. Mira Forrester. Who's that in there then? Can't really see shit, so. 
Someone's gonna catch me peeking or something. All right, let's open it. I got a letter. Fucking hell. Everything's still here. The letters from my family. What would someone want with them? Uh oh. Yeah, what's that? Was someone going through my books? I reckon it's her friend. Why would someone do this? I don't know what it is, but I just don't trust uh, Sarah, 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 Sarah. Don't trust her. I could be completely wrong. She could be absolutely fine, but uh, just something about her. I have information that will aid you with the imp. Meet me in the gardens at midnight. It's always midnight. Always midnight. Oh yeah, yeah. Where are we shooting off to now? There. <clears throat> that should last through Lady Roger. Elena's visit, at least. There's been no news from Mira. She may not have found a way to help with Elena. We'll be fine, Mother. I pray you're right. Lord Glenmore's army could keep us from ruin. But Elena must still agree to the marriage. <clears throat> My lord. You might sure remind Lady agree. Elena that in terms of lineage, you are still very much a man. Maester. What I mean is, if the two of you wanted to produce an heir... I'll make sure she knows. It cannot hurt. Most ladies her age. Enough, Maester. When last we spoke of Elena, you seemed unsure how she might feel about you. You just have to show her that you're still the man she knew. I don't mean to burden you with unwanted advice. Thank you, Mother. This advice well taken. I'm just so glad to see you home. My lord, she's here. Roderick? You look... I know, I'm unspeakably handsome. I see you haven't lost your sense of humor. Yeah, she appreciates it. No. Love that. There's two limbs and half a face. <laughs> Please. So, here we are. You look as beautiful as ever, Elena. Oh, thank you. I set out for Ironrath as soon as I heard you were alive. My father suggested I wait, but I can't believe it's been two years. Your brother's name day feast. We danced until the sun came out. But now your house prepares for a funeral. And you... Tell me the truth, Roderick. How are you, really? And please, be honest with me. I don't mean to pry, but... Yeah. Honestly, I feel fine. I may not look pretty, but... I'm still myself. I'm sure it's worse than that. I know you too well. So much has changed since we were children. Playing hide-and-seek in the grove and... You're so easy to find. You always hid behind the same tree. 
Maybe I wanted you to find me. But Roderick, I am. Um, I need to ask you something. Oh, when I arrived at Ironrath today, your courtyard was filled with drunken soldiers. White Hill soldiers. They said some terrible things. The White Hills are your oldest enemies, Roderick. Why are they here? Has something happened? We weren't given a choice. Those soldiers are here at the orders of the Bolton. That's horrible. Bruce Bolton must mean to occupy Iron No, he just wants to show our loyalty. I'm going to be honest with you, Roderick. I have always looked forward to our marriage. But... But in light of all yeah. that's happened to your family... For fuck's sake. My father is questioning the wisdom of our betrothal. He wants me to call it off. And what do you want? I've been asking myself the same question. And frankly, I'm torn. I don't care about your scars, Roderick. I love the boy you were. And I can love the man you are. But My family can't get drawn into a war with the Boltons. So many butts. They're the Wardens of the North. And they flay their enemies. My house is stronger than it looks. Every one of us is fighting to survive. Even beyond Ironrath. <sighs> it's good to hear you so assured. Fuck yeah, I am. But I have to be practical. Lena. It doesn't matter how we feel. Fuck's sake, I did the How best can I, I ask my father to risk everything? Even for you. Yeah. Because I love you, Elena. Roderick. I wish that was enough. Fuck's sake. I'm it sorry. Be. But I have to think of my family. They don't mean I'm convinced. I'm going to tell fuck's father sake. the betrothal is off. Oh, fuck off then. If it helps, we can delay the announcement. It'll give you time to get your affairs in order. Deepest apologies, my lord. I tried to stop him, but... So, the rumours are true. Oh, this prick. You have no right to just... And if it isn't Elena Glenmore. You're not still marrying into this wretched family. My father has not yet made a decision. Well, for what it's worth, you can do much better than this cripple. And my son Griff needs a bride. Mind your own business, Whitetail. My son's affairs are not your concern. Then why not tell him why you invited me here? Eh? I sent a raven to Lord Whitehill about letting Brian attend the funeral. But I never expected him to barge in like this. Oh, she practically begged me to come. Of course, I'd want the same in her position. The youngest son home to mourn his dead father and brother. Ryan belongs at that funeral, with his family. Not until I'm certain that you know your place. Lord Ramsay ordered your family to obey my soldiers until my son Griff arrives from Harrenhal. And now, I hear you're ordering them around yeah, and keeping it. them dull on wine. It makes me start to question your obedience. Lud. Enough of this. I do not have to obey. See? That's just the kind of arrogance I'm talking about. Sure. Here's the idea. We're going to make a fresh start, you and I. Your brother Ethan called me Craven. But you're a different man entirely, aren't you? So, if you want Ryan at that funeral, Sure, Lady Elena, you respect your betters. Kneel and kiss my shiny ring. Ah. Just do it, Roderick. No, I don't you want to. You don't want to end up like your brother, do you? Please. It means nothing. Oh, and we'll get to see sake. Ryan again. So annoying. Very good. Now then, 
Since you're a loyal subject, I'll need you to pay me a tribute. I'm taking what should have been mine in the first place. The other half of the Ironwood Forest. You can't Ramsey do that. Ramsey Snow I said... know what Ramsey said. I'm saying something else. As of today, I harvest Ironwood from wherever the fuck I please. And you can't do a bloody thing to stop me. Would you defy an express order from House Bolton? I've known Roose Bolton my whole life. As long as he gets his Ironwood, he won't care. Especially when I tell him you've sworn to obey me. That was a sign of respect, not an oath. Well, I have what I came for. I'll leave you to your business. He's an asshole, fair play. Oh, by the way, my men have a name for you. Roderick the Ruined. Isn't that clever? He's a prick. That was quite funny, though. I'll give him that. I can't believe you would submit to him like that. Oh, fuck. I know off. you had your reasons, but... He doesn't deserve your obedience. I did it for Ryan. Maybe I'd have done the same. I knew she'd moan about that. My lord. What? Are you well? I'm going to kill that man. Yeah. Oh, yes I am. I like Roderick, he's fucking cool. Here he is. You can't be fighting with the other recruits. You need those men to have your back. There's enough out here trying to kill us without trouble amongst our own. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm Garrett. Frostfinger told me about you. Seems to think he might be trouble. <laughs> you might be right. He said worse about me. John he said sword is fucking. You fought level. for the north with the foresters. You were there. At the twins. Yes. I still don't understand. Three thousand men, and not one could save my brother. Why didn't anyone fight back? Why didn't they rally to their king? Nobody was expecting it. One minute we were drinking and telling jokes, and, and the next... The phrase cut us open. Those cowards. Couldn't face Rob like men, so they stabbed him in the back. They couldn't even give him an honourable death. Let him die fighting. Your brother would have won the North's freedom. He deserved to be king. He was good at it. He was good at everything. Now the Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. They murdered my family. I should have been there. I keep thinking if I'd been there, I could have done something. But chances are, I'd be dead too. Whatever I once thought, my place is here. With the Night's Watch. There are those here who will hate you for who you are. Southerners who will call you traitor. Northerners who will call you craven. Some won't even have a reason. They'll hate you anyway. You can't do anything about it. Trust me, I know. I don't care if they hate me. 
Let them think what they like. Ignoring them won't be as easy as you think. Most of the men are criminals forced to take the black. You were a squire for a noble house. What happened to you today happened to me more times than I can count. I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. <sighs> Sweet. I felt the same first time I saw it. I heard you want to be a ranger. Why? Why risk your life out there? To find the North Grove. The North Grove? <laughs> you serious? Old Nan used to tell us a tale about ice dragons and trees tall as the sky. Why would you want to find the North Grove? Why does it matter to you? It's important to House Forrester. Better keep that to yourself. Yeah, I don't mind revealing my secret to Jon Snow. Jon Snow is fucking... Not many awesome. recruits want to be rangers. They'd rather stay here where they think they'll be warm and safe. But Mance Raider marches on the wall with a hundred thousand wildlings. I've seen them for myself. The men here are murderers. Thieves, rapers. You won't like most of them, and they won't like you. But they're your brothers now. Can you stand with them? Can you see past your differences? I'll stand with them. Glad to hear it. I'd say you'll get used to the cold. But you won't. Come on. Better get by a fire, or you'll end up like Frostfinger. Sweet. I'm really enjoying all of the storylines so far. I'm here, but where are you? This time of night. I was just headed back to my room. It's a little late to be out, isn't it? Do you know what this uniform means? It means you serve the Lannisters. So, you best get yourself back to your chambers. And I mean, now. If you don't like it, you can take it up with the commander. Can't I just stay a while longer? Please. Did you not hear me? Um. At ease, Lucan. The lady is with me. Yes, sir. Sure. Enjoy maybe your I, night. Maybe I should have uh, called out to him. I hope he wasn't bothering you, my lady. I'm Damien. Thank you, Damien. It was my pleasure. You got my note. Oh, that was you. I'm very glad you could make it. So who's this dude then? I've been wanting to talk to you for quite some time. Did you search my room? What were you looking for? Nothing, Lady Mira. I only wish to leave you a note. I thought it was going to be like Varus or uh, Baelish or something. But nope. 
I this am dude. sorry about this, Mira. But you've Five. made enemies of the wrong people. Standard. A handmaiden should know her place. What? What are you talking about? I'll make this quick if that helps. Oh, for fuck. I hate to see you suffer. Quite a lot. Fuck's sake. Alright, go again. We'll go again. <gasps> Alright, up. There we go. <laughs> Definitely saving that little lad. He's he's men. He's a good lad. You? What 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 happened? What what was that? He he said I'd angered the wrong people. So someone sent him? What are you doing here? I heard yelling. He's a good lad. You did what you had to do, Lady Mira. You had no choice. I need to get back. Someone might see me. I'll take care of him. I know a few places in Fleabot. Good lad. No one will ever find him. Don't tell anyone. I won't. He's a good lad. Everything all right, sir? <gasps> oh, shit. Damien, where are you? I'm gonna get caught with it. I should have threw it away. Fuck. Fuck. Should have threw it away. Whoops. I'm gonna get caught with that knife. But if I threw it away, someone's gonna find it. Yeah. It's you, isn't it? Roderick. They said you were gone. Ramsay Snow did this. He did that to Ethan. You're going to hurt him, aren't you? Lord Whitehouse says you won't, because you're a coward. But I know you will. He deserves it. He hurt Ethan. I'm gonna kill Ramsay Snow for what he did. That's enough. Your little chat is over. Get out of my way. Now, I said you're done. Yeah, Keep your distance or I'll drag him back to high point right now. What? I have to go back? No. I want to come home. Roderick, you should speak to Mother. Roderick? Are you going to forget about me? Are you? We are your family, Ryan. Don't forget that. All right. I won't. Please hurry. How about a story? No, no. You've had your chance. He's a child. What harm could it do? Make it a quick one. Mother. Come join the others. He's right there. My son. But soon they'll take him from me just like before. It's happening all over again. I can see it. My father's house was once mighty like this one. But his loyalty to the Targaryens cost us dearly. 
I watched as countless of our kin fell, saw our lands destroyed, everything we clung to was ripped from our hands. I can't watch that same fate before this family. Our house. My children. I won't let that happen to us. You must be ready to defend us, Roderick. I will. Your body may be damaged, but your spirit must be like iron. You let nothing stand in your way, do you understand? Oh, yeah. If you have to murder every last white till down to the babes in their beds, yes. no matter what, you must do it. Promise me. I will kill anyone who stands in my way. I will do whatever it takes. Remember that. You must be ready. Promise me. We will be ready, Mother. Mira, Asher, even Garrett. They all stand with us. We are strong. Yes. I suppose we have to be. A king and then all. I know it's completely irrelevant right now, but... Would you say a few words, my lord? Yes. Yes, I will. My father. He, he was everything. Everything I ever wanted to be. He showed me what it is to be a lord. He was always honourable. I never knew a better man. And I am... I am sorry. I love you, father. Ethan, my little brother. He stood up to Ramsay Snow. He saved our sister's life and paid with his own. He was only a boy. You should have said, but he died a man. That would have been quality. See, I can write speeches. We honour Lord Gregor Forrester. My husband. My love. And our Lord Ethan. My sweet little boy. Now is time to say goodbye. Father and son are returned to the earth, to the ice. And from their sacrifice, new life begins. Iron from ice. Iron, Iron from ice. From ice. <laughs> Iron from ice. From eyes, from eyes, we forced us born to eyes, we all return. Father, brother, I've sworn, I've sworn to guard this rest you've earned. I'd bear my neck to Swim the shivering sea, paint slavers bay in crimson rains to bring Ethan back to me. Snow grabbed me from my mother's grasp to claim me as his prize.
good couldn't ah i didn't want to say nothing oh i think i've done that episode now see next time on game of the roots what is going on hey, roderick on? you have to do something oh. lord whitehill's son has arrived griff whitehill means to torment us nothing worse than a fourth born with something to prove it was bad enough when it was just the soldiers we can't live with them under our roof. Form up and follow my lead. You'll be taking your vows. You too, Tuttle. Time to start proving you're a brother. Oh, the things we do for family. I wonder sometimes if it's worth it, all the sacrifices. Enjoy the wedding. How much further to Marine? A few days. If the Lost Legion doesn't catch up to us first. No. No what? I overheard a couple of men whispering about the Lannister Guard. They're questioning people. Is there anything else we need to be worried about? Shit. What was that? Oh, shit. Sweet. Fucking sweet. Okay. Me and 76% of people didn't forge my just letter. Oh, only if, oh, only me and 29.8% kissed the ring. Oh, fuck. You and 51% has lost Roderick's betrothal. Yeah, that was fucking difficult, though. You and 95 of players stood to court after you stole it. That's cool. And a lot of us killed attacker. Yeah, you had to save that little lad. He was quality. Sweet. From eyes, from eyes, we forced us cool. so, born I'm going to end this episode here, and then in the next one we're going to start episode three. This is awesome, that song's awesome, that's playing right now. And uh, I can't wait to keep playing this, I'm really enjoying it, I'm enjoying all the storylines at the moment. Really, really fun. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in the next one.